Good morning, Alaska. What's up, guys? It is a beautiful day here in Palmer, Alaska. We are going to go harvest a Christmas tree. Hey, did what? you know the nation's Christmas tree came from Alaska this year? It did. Our Christmas tree, like the nation, ah, like yeah. the one in front of the White House yeah. came from Alaska. So, you know, that's kind of cool, too. But yeah, so this place uh, you can actually harvest. We made sure we looked it up. Uh, the state says this is one of those designated areas. You don't even need a permit, which is super, super cool. Of course, last year we harvested our tree from our friend's like backyard, which to me isn't really from the wild. It's from David's house. You know, it wasn't that big, um, but we still have it. And we're making Christmas ornaments out of the tree last year, which is super cool. So it's not like the tree is like, you know, one use and it's done. No, plus we get to burn it. Yeah. And stay warm. Exactly. There we go. In that footprint. Oh, it's a moose. So after a bit of hiking, I think we found a good place. Lots of big trees here. Of course, we're not going to take anything like that, but I wish. How amazing would that be? But no, right over there, look, right where the sun is, there's a tree that looks really pretty. How you doing? A little cold. Yeah, a little bit cold. It's in the teens. I think it might even be like lower. It's cold. All right, so let's uh, let's head over there and see how that one looks. Kristen sees a couple more. <laughs> I don't know how to get there. Yeah, well, we'll just uh, pick a direction. That one on the right looks okay. Over there? Yeah. Okay. I can hear chainsaws in the distance, but we're the smart ones who didn't bring a chainsaw because ours <laughs> is electric. We did bring a uh, handsaw though. It's, you yeah. know, but still, like a chainsaw would be pretty nice. I don't see any trees that'll work. <laughs> They're all like monsters. Yeah, and you can't just cut the tops off. That's No, that's one of the rules. Yeah. All right, tree. So it looks kind of big, but I think this one's gonna do. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> I think this tree, my looks of it's probably 15 feet because me times two plus, you know, yeah, probably. three feet. So what we're going to do, I see right here is a nice bottom for it. I know there's like, it looks like this is going to waste, but what we'll do is we'll actually like use this bit. For pretty decorations? Decorations, uh, for a wreath, Yeah. Uh, for anything else we want to do around the house, but yeah. Let's do it. And by that, I mean, you do it. <laughs> ah, trusty chainsaw. <laughs> ah, nah. Do you want me to make sound effects for you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, it's okay. <laughs> All right, let's see. So I'm gonna cut it into two parts because I want to use the whole tree. So yeah, I'll cut it. Wait, where is our middle? This is. Is this? That's our middle. Or our, our bottom. Okay. So I'll cut it here and then I'll cut it down at the bottom. <laughs> oh shoot! <laughs> Did I hit you? Are no, you good? I'm good. Okay. Good no. job. Thank you. I'm not a very good lumberjack, though. <laughs> I, oh, timber! <laughs> it smells good. Yeah, it does. And what's neat is we can take all the little pine cones off of this because they're all like closed up for the most part. Yep. And we can plant them. Yeah, yeah. And keep it going. Sorry. Some eye right. tree. Excuse me. I'll set that in there like that. There we go. And then get this last part. As close to the ground as you can get it. Yep. That's the rule. I'm not gonna lie, that saw works better than I thought it would. Good Timber. job. See, I did it. Yeah, a little bit late. Yeah, I'll work yeah. on the timing a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. All right. Good job, though. 
Yeah, dude, this this is a really nice trunk. We can cut that up and send that to family. Like yeah. little ornaments. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Timber. It didn't fall. <laughs> Good oh. job. Only like 15 more. 15 more. Dude, these, you're right, these do smell really good. Ah. I can't feel my fingers. You can't feel your fingers. I can't feel my toes. <laughs> there we go. Cool. That's a, that's a nice pole, isn't it? Yeah. Make this into a... A coat rack? Exactly. That's what I was literally about to say. She wants a coat rack. I've always wanted a cool coat rack. Yeah. All so, right. Let's go. Let's get out of here. <laughs> I'm so cold. All right. We made it. The tree is back in one piece. Well, two technically. <laughs> But uh, yeah, now I gotta load it on top of the Jeep. And to do that, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the, uh, the straps that I had for my canoe and make it easy. Last year, it was really sketchy. I can't remember if we used the Jeep or the car, but I just remember it was a really scary ride. But this year, mm. ooh, so cold my face is like barely moving. I wanna put this away now. Ah, oh, what a beautiful drive home. Christmas lights, need to do Christmas lights. I was gonna do that today, but it's getting dark. You know, it's four o'clock. Probably shouldn't do it at four o'clock. I should have did it earlier. Home sweet home and garage that probably won't work. Come on, you. See, every time you touch that thing and it works like a freaking charm. <laughs> oh my. It's because it's my garage door. That's true. Okay, for real, like yeah. come out and look at our tree. Is it beautiful? Look at it. Does that look like just the scrawniest tree in the world? It looks like a beautiful tree. It does. It looks like a beautiful tree, but the problem is it's just... It's perfect for us. It is. We might knock it over with all the ornaments we have, but it's going to be great. <laughs> Like that's almost embarrassing. We saw the most beautiful trees driving here. Like we saw all these people with like huge trees. One Jeep. Oh my God, where was it a Jeep? Is it was it... like a Yukon like big SUV thing. Yeah, dude, they had this huge tree and they were pulled off the side of the road and I'm like, really, the, you're taking that? The tree was bigger than their vehicle. Like, yeah. Height wise and, and width wise and everything. everything. <laughs> yeah, it's almost as bad as our big trees. By the way, she was saying, she's like, when we have kids, like when they're here, because <laughs> we're already year. having the babies. Um, we're going to actually decorate these trees. Wouldn't that be cool? That would be so cool. Anyways, guys, I, uh, I'm going to go ahead and load this tree up into the house. Load it up, bring it in the house. Yeah. yeah. And then uh, tomorrow you guys will actually get to see all that stuff. So thanks for watching. I'll see you then. Okay, we'll let you out. <laughs> Penny has to pee. <laughs> Goodbye. I do too. <laughs> Whoa, damn, I gotta do that again! <laughs> saying goodbye to sunshine, saying goodbye to warm Heading to Alaska where ice will be the norm So much to see, so much to do And the best part is we're sharing it with you Do like hella!